it has literally been like 84 years since I last recorded one of these and I don't even know what's going on anymore. But hey guys, it's your girl Fairy Queens here and welcome back to another episode of the full game walkthrough. I can't tell you what went on in the last episode because I have admittedly taken a huge break from this walkthrough series so I don't remember. But I'm sure you guys can go rewatch it if you haven't seen it already. All I know is that today we are taking on Crimson Fields. I just woke up today and I was like, you know what sounds really fun? Mushu. I don't even know who I am anymore. But nonetheless, today we are going to be taking on this iconic dungeon called Crimson Fields. So without any further ado, let's get started. It's been so long since I've done this dungeon, I, I don't really remember what goes on, but it's not like I ever paid attention to the storyline anyway, because I didn't. Samurai Sojiro Gama sent you. I welcome your help. You must defeat the war Oni and recover the Emperor's sword. We have been waiting for you. If you would honor the general with your presence, please take this to him in the fort. They've been waiting for me for that long? <gasps> oh my god, it's been months. I feel so bad. I really feel like I have let the village of Mushu down just because I have waited so long to record another episode. Ah, so you've come for his Imperial Majesty's sword. I assure you, you won't leave here without it. Warlord Katsumori is preparing a counterattack. If we don't prepare our defenses, he could reclaim the village and outpost you worked so hard to free. We must rebuild our barricades. While my men hold the line, gather wood from the piles near here. We will put it to good use. You also may notice that um, my keyboard's a little more clanky than it used to be. Like, I think in my last episodes, I had my old keyboard and now I have a mechanical one, so... Yeah, it's clanky, I'm sorry. I mean, some people like it. Some people think it's like ASMR. I, I feel like it's probably annoying, so sorry. You have more than fulfilled your duty. Your willingness to help honors me, wizard. Aw, no problem. Rebuild the barricades along the edge of the fort with this wood. As you strengthen our defenses, you strengthen our chances against Warlord Katsumori. Okay, that was easy. I literally didn't even have to do anything. I just walked over to it, but that was easy. Your work, though it was humble, has immense value. I don't know why Warlord Katsumori has attacked, nor do I care. All I know is never to underestimate Warlord Katsumori. Dude, I feel like I could take him on easily. By his Imperial Majesty's throne, Warlord Katsumori knew we would rebuild the barricades here, so he attacked our scout towers. What? He, that's so mean! I am a fool. He himself taught me to strengthen defenses before every battle. He counted on me to follow my training. Fortunately, we turned back his attack, but not before his forces had chased my scouts into the forest. Find the scouts so we can keep watch on Warlord Katsumori's movements. Guys, paying attention to the storyline is actually, like, so intense. I mean, you know me. <laughs> Whenever I'm questing, I just, like, speed through all of it. I don't listen to anything. I just want to get out of there as soon as I can. And I just want to level up my character as soon as I can. But now it's like, oh my god, this is so intense. I can't wait to find Warlord Katsumori's scouts. It is safe to return? Thank you, Revered Wizard. I will return to my post. Orders from Rikugon. Thank you, esteemed wizard. I will return to my post. The scouts have begun reporting to me. Thank you. You're so welcome. I am ashamed that I played into Warlord Katsumori's hands. Without you, much more would have been lost. Oh my god, you're making me blush. Stop. My first duty is to his Imperial Majesty, but my second duty is to the land. The spirits of the Earth have called for help, and we must answer. My men are getting into battle position. Could you speak with Bricktop, the Colossus nearby? If you can help, it would honor both the Emperor and the land. You have come in our hour of need. You need a bra. The trolls have taken our sacred stone. Losing it weakens us. The enemy of my enemy is my friend. Win the stone from the troll called Grom Foultooth, and we can fight. 
Someone get this man a bra. Okay, side note, I am so, so, so glad that they incorporated teleporters. Because without them, I... Grum like oh. war. Grum make war with you and win. Um, yeah. Anyway, I'm so glad that they incorporated teleporters because I'm so tired of walking. Okay, so he's myth. I'm gonna carry a couple monstrous TC. And... Yeah, that's fine. Okay, let's go. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay. All right, let's go. I'll go ahead and start out with a blade storm. Dude, I know we're like so far away from sharpened blade, but that's gonna be so fun to like... Okay, because all I do is blade. Like, that's all I do. But it's gonna be so fun to have more options. Diana's gonna be so buff because of me. I don't even know if I need to, like, judge. So I'm just gonna blade her again. She carries me, literally. And it's been a while since I've done this, so I don't remember what goes on. <laughs> I literally don't. This, this will kill, right? Right? Oh my god! Well, that was easy. I guess I had nothing to worry about. Dude, we're so OP. I remember now, we've been like breezing through this world because it's like not even a challenge. I mean, eventually it'll be hard, you know, like once we get to Celestia, it'll be difficult. But we've been breezing through it. You have the secret stone. That I do. Use the stone on the two cairns outside the fort for victory over your enemy. Okay, booby man. I kind of want to title this episode booby man, but then I'll get like banned. I will defend this path, wizard. None shall pass. I will defend this path, oh. wizard. <laughs> None shall pass. Did you just, like, teleport over here to say the exact same thing? What? Okay. <laughs> that was weird. Does no one, like, question the weird parts of this game? Like, do we all just accept it and continue on? Thank you, living creature. We will fight against your enemy. Tell Rikugan. Hello, Rikugan. I see that the Earth itself has joined our fight. We would not have found such strong allies without you. Thank you, wizard. My scouts have reported that Warlord Katsumori is moving his troops back. But he taught me too well. He is trying to trick us and intends to attack at once. You can turn the tide of battle. Defeat those forces attacking at the front and we can claim victory today. For his imperial majesty! For his imperial majesty! Everyone scream it with me. Pause the video and type it. For his imperial majesty! Dead. Dead, dead, dead. Honestly, why am I even carrying anything other than blades? Like, why do I even think that I need those? You've done it! Warlord Katsumori's forces are on the run. You have earned our unending respect today. My men have found a secret entrance into Warlord Katsumori's fortress. Now you can seize his Imperial Majesty's sword. Did you think I had forgotten? <laughs> yeah, I did, honestly. Once my sword was stolen, and I was lost. But a collector from Wizard City returned it to me. The sword is truly the spirit of the samurai. Enter Warlord Katsumori's fortress and win the sword. You will find a worthy foe in Warlord Katsumori. Or his most benevolent majesty! It, is it in here? Oh my god, I'm so scared! Oh my god, his house is so pretty! Oh my god, this is beautiful! Oh my god, hold on. What? I need to take a picture. You have shown skill to reach me, but this is where your luck runs out. Okay, we may not like Warlord Katsumori, but I think we all need to come together to admit that his house is beautiful. Okay, since this boss is fire, I don't know if she has converts or not, but I'm just going to bring a judgment just in case. Let's go! He doesn't even have that much health, honestly. 
Okay, good. She has a convert, so I'll just blade her. And then I'll blade her again. Look how simple! Yay! We did you it. You have defeated me as Katsumori. <gasps> Now, face me as the War Oni. Oh my god, I forgot about this. I will take you down with force you've never seen before. Um, how did he transform? Um, I don't understand. But still, his health, like, isn't that high, so I think we're fine. Literally, we're just using the same strategy, that's it. Using a fire cat on me. How pathetic. Yay! You have found the Emperor's sword. You have returned. What news from the front lines? You have the sword. Because of you, my family and I have honored His Imperial Majesty. Perhaps you have also restored the honor of Warlord Katsumori. I must make one last request. Take the sword to the High Monk, Tan King, within the Jade Palace. It was your battle. You deserve the honor, wizard. You'll bring honor to us, you'll bring honor to us, you'll bring honor to us all. His Imperial Majesty's sword. I should have trusted that you were the one fated to bring it back. But I was not certain until now. Tan King. The High Monk of Mushu listens gravely to your battlefield report. What? You fought and defeated an Oni demon? With his Imperial Majesty in a weakened state, the Oni may well have possessed others beside Warlord Katsumori. This is most troubling. We can take nothing for granted. I felt assured that the healing waters of Mushu could cure his benevolent Majesty's mind. But now I worry. Our brothers currently care for these waters. Please visit Sun Hing at Shoshan Village and make sure the water runs pure. Okay, okay, so it makes sense now. He was possessed. I get it. Okay. See, that's what happens when you pay attention to the storyline. All of the missing pieces of the puzzle come together and your mind is blown. Well, that is the end of this episode today, but I have a question. Would you guys like me to do Soshun Village next, or would you like me to do Aquila next? We are level 30 after all. Type which one you'd rather prefer down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to leave a big thumbs up and a comment down below. Bye!